Welcome to the Solar Decathlon Minute. Day eight in the assembly process means these teams only have one more day to complete their houses. Here is event director Richard King to introduce today's stories. Every team needs to undergo rigorous safety inspections before they're allowed to compete. Although there's no official prize for being finished first, can you really put a price on bragging rights? SU! 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 Now let's go see New York City Tech and San Luis Obispo. We are in New York City Tech from the New York City College of Technology in Brooklyn, and this is our first time competing. The Durham Home is an all wood frame structure, and we chose wood because it's a renewable resource and it's a breathable resource. Because our house is made out of wood, it also presents challenges in terms of getting the modules back together. Getting the bolts within a quarter of an inch is definitely a major challenge. The result is um, a lot of shifting and a lot of movement and a lot of nail biting. <laughs> but now that the structure's in place, it should all be smooth sailing, right? We use a facade panel that's somewhat brittle, a uh, cement board, and on the way here, it suffered a lot of damage. Fortunately, we had a lot of raw material. Utilizing that raw material and recutting those panels um, was definitely time consuming and unplanned for. So that was a major challenge. When asked about a predicted completion time, we were told no comment, but it was said with a smile. We are Team Solar Cal Poly. Our house's name is in-house and Cal Poly has competed in the Solar Decathlon once before in 2005. So one of our challenges was that we have very few students here because we are in the middle of a 10 week school session. And so with that, we had to provide a house that was mostly complete when we got here to minimize the amount of labor needed on site. We planned our days um, very efficiently to accommodate the labor that we had and with that we were able to keep our daily goals and keep the whole project on schedule and it worked very successfully for us. So I asked if they'd be done ahead of schedule as predicted. We were checking off our inspections very quickly, very efficiently and we were head in head um, to get them done first. We unfortunately did not get them done first, but we are aiming to get second in our inspection completion. And right now we're actually about to sign off on um, two of them. And so we'll only have a few left today. <laughs> we definitely plan on finishing all of our inspections today. That's it for today's Solar Decathlon Minute. Subscribe now to the City of Irvine's YouTube channel to receive daily updates right to your phone or inbox. And mark your calendars to visit the Orange County Great Park so you can tour the most advanced, self-sufficient solar homes on the planet and meet the forward-thinking college students that designed and built them.